All right, I'm Matt Caper Tools. Today, let's go over the six volt to 12 volt battery charger. So I'm not sure if your situation, but I actually do have batteries that I need to keep maintained because it is winter, the batteries are no longer in the vehicles. So I actually do need sort of like a trickle charger for to keep these batteries maintained throughout the winter. And DeWalt actually has something that'll suit that for like 20 bucks. Totally worth it already. Like tw this is 20, 25 bucks. I'll put the exact, exact price in right now. There are tons of battery chargers, but I want a battery charger that is actually a name brand that I have up on the wall. And DeWalt actually has a perfect one. So let's unbox this, go over the specs of this really quick and then see on how well these, and see if this actually does the trick. When it comes to this, I actually want to tell you the specs of this. 120 volts at 60 Hertz, six volt to 12 volt with a two amp hour, uh, two amp charge. The flip up hook makes hanging easy, mounting holes to uh, secure permanently, six volt to 12 volt switch to select battery voltage, LED charging uh, status indicator, impact resistant heavy duty housing, battery clamps and temporary connection, ring terminals for permanent connection, which you could uh, screw this on like you do on a, a battery car so you don't have to use clips, the clamps. Quick connector, six foot heavy duty power cord for long reach, that's good. So six feet of power cord, but I'm also wondering how long the actual cord, the cables are for the connections. It's a very simple unboxing, you guys. Let's just uh, open this up. And like I said, I'm glad I got this because I do need to, I have a, a multiple batteries that I gotta keep uh, maintained. Got instructions. Uh, let's see what the warranty is. The model number for this is DXA EC2. What's the warranty? Might say it on the box. It guaranteed tough. Uh, it has one year a limited warranty or a, and a 90 day money back guarantee. One year limited warranty, 90 day money back guarantee. All right, so got just got instructions and warranty and it has reverse polarity protection. So you can't mess this up by connecting those two together when it's connected to the wall. I like that. That is actually a nice body. I like the matte finish on that. All right, but let's see what this, all right, like it, like it does say it has, it has these two, it has the actual clamps. All right, so to use the permanent connections, which I think is awesome because you know, you're not in a situation to all, always where you could use these. So that's, this is where the permanent connection goes because you could either have the clips in, which I like that clips is separate. Now you could put these on or have a permanent, permanent cable, which that's nice. That's a good feature to have in case if you're in a situation where you can't use clamps. That's smart. All right, but I am in a situation where I can use clamps. So let's see, let's, uh, there are the 60 volt to 12 volt is switch is right there. Just slide it left or right. Like I said, I do like this finish. Like it's like a, I don't know what material that is, but it's a nice finish. Right, but let's plug this in and uh, just put these on charge for a little bit. Cause I know it's gonna charge it, you guys. This isn't something that you're, it's not going to work. As long as it initiates the charge, then this thing is going to be good. Which I do, I might need to replace my uh, big battery for the boat because that I bought that in 2016. I think it might be time to uh, change out that core. Be like you, this, you, this is how you prevent batteries from being ruined. All right, I will say right off the bat, you are going to have to do this, which it's designed for, but people get nervous to do it. I'm just letting you know it is okay. If you do that, leave a little bit there. So this doesn't get too damaged. Leave like about an inch of that connected still, because I do need a much longer reach than those connected. So it is okay. If you, if you separate those two for a longer reach. All right. So let's connect negative. Then positive. Let's see, I'm wondering if there is a uh, oh, 12 volt, sorry. This unit already knows what voltage this is and it will not work if it's uh, switched to the wrong one. It was on uh, six volt, but it didn't operate. So I switched it back to the 12, then it turned on. Uh, it says the battery is actually full. These are brand new batteries. All right, let's do this one. 
negative, positive. All right, it says it's charging. Okay, these are full. Then let's connect it to the, to the big one, which I guarantee you that this is not full because I didn't use the boat as, mu uh, as much this year. It says it's charging. If you're in a situation where you could use uh, an actual battery charger that's not a big, huge unit, that's something small and portable like this, I highly recommend you guys get this. But these two batteries are full, so I don't have to worry about those right now. We'll ch I'll check them back in on these with spring. But yeah, this one does need charging, which uh, I'm not too... I'll charge this one uh, later tonight. I don't need to charge it right now. But yeah, but I did need one of these, and I'm glad I got it. I am very glad I got this. It's a good price. It's DeWalt. It has a good warranty system on it. And so yeah, this, will be, this is going to be majorly useful throughout all year round for me because I will be using this a lot to charge up these batteries. So I don't have to worry about the alternator uh, on the boat charging that. Because all it takes is for the bat for the boat not to start once to get stranded out in the water and you need to get towed. So this is essential for what I what I need this for. So, so that's pretty much it, you guys. I hope you found this video helpful and entertaining. Please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos. And please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave and Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.